balls out and we're washing the balls. That's just making all that noise. There, all the balls falling into that hopper. Uh, we're trying to wash them. We got the space heater going. We're trying to warm up the area. Cause it's so cold, right? Mucho cold, right? All right, so I literally just got done running around the block. Uh, I ran the whole time, so I'm kind of proud of myself. Uh, I'm out of breath. I'm out of shape. Uh, I just joined a gym, uh, CrossFit. Uh, you know, it's something I really got to work on, and this just kind of proves it. Uh, man, I am so out of shape. Uh, so I just climbed up the stairs. Uh, it was just a little warm up. I'm gonna um, start stretching. So, yeah, bye. guys don't mind me I'm just like stretching cuz uh, I just got done with my CrossFit class um, it went amazing I actually just made a video in the car but it was really crappy and I didn't feel like posting that one um, where I talked all about how this class went and how um, basically how I feel it's working um, I've lost five pounds now in the past three days um, a lot of this is just due to diet um, and I, I I actually my diet's been pretty good I felt like but um, I added just a little bit of exercise over the weekend I went for a few runs on my own um, today was my first day at the class and it was beyond what I could have expected um, everyone there is super friendly um, just well oriented to what goes on I obviously felt like I was a little behind in part of the class but uh, that's to be expected when you don't have a clue how the class is gonna go um, just want to say to anybody who is thinking about joining CrossFit go to Goose Island Gro CrossFit uh, I would highly recommend that gym to anyone um, I mean, other than that, I had a really good speech in the car, and it just was really crappy video, so I decided not to post it. But I uh, just want to let you guys know about a little bit of progress that I've uh, done. Um, I know the one challenge is going to be tomorrow. Can I just go way here? No. Um, I'm going to go right here. Yes. Yeah. <gasps> Having this spell. Oh. oh. Okay. Alright guys, so uh, I made a Facebook Live video, but this is somebody's phone that I found, and then um, I was actually just driving to pick up my son, and it showed up dad ice on here. So Christina yeah. answered it, 
Um, and he's going to actually pick it up. He's going to call me again, and we're going to meet up and just give it to him. He's actually one of my neighbors, pretty much. He, like, doesn't live... He lives really close to here. So, like I said, I was just walking to my car this morning, and I found this phone uh, face down on the ground. And uh, I was just going to take it to Verizon. You can see it's a Verizon phone. Um, it just keeps lighting up. Yeah, it's a Verizon phone. Um... So, just a little update, yeah, just do the right thing, bye. Alright, so I'm just like here in the alley, uh, he just called and I said, yeah, we'll meet in the alley, so, um, kind of cool, it's kind of nice to, you know, like you're getting somebody's phone back to him. I'm not sure if, they're in this building here, so, um, yeah. Huh? And I, don't see you. I see you. Now I can. Wave. <laughs> Christine is like all the way up there. Look, I'm like poking her. Dink, dink, dink. <laughs> huh? Huh? Hey. How's it going? Is this your last phone? Yes. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. Yeah, I found it. I found it right here. So, <laughs> sure. I was gonna turn it into Verizon because I was like, "Who's is it?" Yeah, and I was like, I, you know, I, I I thought about it for a second. I was like, "Well, I could leave it, but then somebody else might take it, you know, and not be as good as me." So I was no, like, "No, yeah, I haven't even told him." I, go, <laughs> I, was, I actually we called and I'm like, "Maybe," because he said he turned it off. Uh huh. So I'm like, "Maybe it's in the house." You know how like it vibrates. Yeah. <laughs> and I was surprised uh, when your girlfriend picked up. I'm like, "Okay, great." It, at least it's not gone forever. <laughs> yeah. Hey, right, thank you very yeah, much. Yeah, sure, my no name's problem. Eddie, by the way. My, my name's Kevin. Good to meet you, Kevin. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Sure. Good day today. See this old tractor here? We're gonna try to get it started with some ether popper. I don't think anything's even coming out of here. Eh. Kinda sorta. It's an old diesel tractor. John Deere 870. It was cranking before and then the battery seemed like it was about to go dead. So we got a battery light. We'll see. <laughs> yes! A little ether bunny. And we're good. Give her a little bit of throttle. There we go. Now the only thing is uh clutch down here, the stick doesn't really do anything. So that bottle that I just left on the front is probably just gonna fall off. Hopefully it doesn't get run over or something. But we got her going. 